My name is Gwendal Castellan. I'm coming to you from the unceded territories of the Musqueam, the Squamish and the tsleil nations, which we otherwise might know as Vancouver, British Columbia. I work as the manager of sustainable destination development for Destination Vancouver. Two really critical things that I'm working on. One is the relationship of tourism and the visitor economy to Indigenous nations, thinking about what is the legacy of colonialism uh, with tourism and how might we rebuild um, tourism coming out of the COVID crisis in a way um, that is not building back, but building forward and includes the, really the benefits that can come through tourism for the communities while creating transformative experiences for visitors as well. Uh, and that includes uh, Indigenous people as part of that experience as full partners. The other project is sustainable tourism. And in particular at the moment is really thinking about the um, climate legacy of tourism and how might destinations really become part of the solution towards uh, decarbonizing travel. Divine discontent, <laughs> which is the idea that there is possibility for a better world or better systems uh, that, are, that are more supportive. Taking the time to listen, to, to put forward ideas, but to really listen and understand how people in that system, what is their worldview? How are they, how are they conceiving the challenges ahead of them? And then presenting solutions in a way that is congruent with their worldview, seize the moment. And sometimes it's not the right moment for you, but it's the moment for the system. And hopefully your, your sensing of the system is, is, is accurate, um, but it may not be. And that's the third is really uh, to try, try, try again. An example is when you're climbing a, uh, on a hike, you're climbing a mountain or something, you have usually at least three or four false peaks. You, you come to the first bump and you think, okay, the next one, that's gonna be the peak. And, and you get to that one and then you see the next peak. And it's not until three or four peaks later that you actually get to the top of the mountain. Be kind to yourself and be kind to others as, uh, as you uh, embark on this journey.